Hello, today we'll be taking a look at the Crane King Dragon Ball Collection Son Goku figurine. I guess you could also call it a statue. So, here's Son Goku, early Dragon Ball. Uh, this is one of a two-piece set. There's also Kareran, also known as Krillin. Um in his uh, Shaolin Temple Gi. Uh, this is when they were training with uh, Muten Roshi, the Turtle Hermit. And uh, so you see Goku still has his um, blue pants. Uh, he still ties his belt with the, uh, the light blue, uh, sometimes white belt. And he's wearing a tank top like a standard tank top instead of uh, his uh, typical gi top. But uh, let's take a closer look at this. Um, here we have a side profile. There he is with the container, the milk container, and the kami house. Uh, we'll do another rotation here. Uh, here's the, the sticker for uh, the uh, localization. Um, it's distributed, uh, I forget by who, um, I think it's like Blue Sky or something like that. Uh, I could be wrong though. And, uh, there you go, another piece of, uh, classic Dragon Ball art. Uh, nice box design. Here we have the top of the box. And the plain bottom. So let's open this guy up. I've already cracked the seal, but I have not actually opened the box. I uh, just uh, cut the tape to make it a little uh, more painless. So I don't know how well you can see that, but there's uh, there he is packed in there. Lift this out. So there's his base. Nothing left in the box. Just set that aside. Here's his stand. And um, here's some Goku himself. It's a nice figure. Let's pop him open. So he comes in uh, just one piece. No assembly required uh, aside from placing him on his base. So let's pull him out of the bag. Take a closer look. There you go. They did a nice job with his hair, I think. Everybody kind of does it a little differently. I like their interpretation. Uh, there's the Nioibo. Uh Non-removable, just kind of sitting in there. Uh, he's, he's pretty weighty. Oh, and he's missing his tail um, at this point in the story uh, because uh, it's after uh, they fought Pilaf and the crew. And there's the holes for his pizzas. So I am gonna pop out the face. Set our young hero on it. I don't know if there's a yeah there's just a copyright one here, 2016. So this is a relatively new figure. Relatively new release. So it's going to take a little effort, it looks like. Oh wow, it like sucks into my desk here. Can you hear that? <laughs> so, that's actually kind of nice. A natural suction 
so you don't necessarily have to worry about him coming off a shelf. Um, do a quick spin around and wrap up the video. I want to say thank you for watching, and uh, if I pick up the Krillin, Krillin, um, little ball friend of Son Goku, I'll uh, do a video on that as well. This figure was twenty four ninety five at Barnes and Noble before tax. Um, I think it's a relatively good value. It's uh, like I said, it's another one of the Crane King series. So it's similar to um, uh, the Fukatsu no F uh, statues they've released. Um, I mean, they've done Dragon Ball Z ones. They've done a lot of them. But uh, I think 25 isn't a bad price. Those usually are 30, 35. Um, so uh, yeah, I'd, I'd say if you are looking for a statue um, or a display piece and you like Dragon Ball a lot, um, particularly uh, this early arc. Um, you really can't go wrong with this figure. Great paint job, uh, great sculpt, um, steady base, um, and affordable price. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and um, like, comment, subscribe uh, for more videos. I do food reviews, all sorts of stuff. Take it easy, guys.